Welcome to the Bosch Condens 5000W 30 system and 37 kilowatt combi boiler commissioning video. Firstly, to confirm the correct model designation, refer to the appliance label. This table shows the Condens 5000 range model designations and the label is located on the front fascia. The next step is to ensure all air is bled from the system. Ensure the air elimination valve cap is open to allow air trapped in the hydraulic block to escape. Now loosen the pump bleed screw to allow air to be removed from the head of the pump. Retighten the screw. The most important part of commissioning the Bosch Condens 5000 is to ensure the correct gas pressure is supplied to the gas valve. To test the correct gas inlet pressure, first isolate the gas supply and then lower the front fascia. Locate the gas valve inlet test point and loosen the captive screw. Attach the manometer. Now lift the front fascia back into the closed position. Check for the correct system water pressure. This should be approximately 1.2 bar cold or in the green section. And turn the gas supply back on. Turn the gas appliance on and ensure the thermostat has a heat demand. Now press the chimney sweep button until illuminated. This will take approximately 10 seconds. Once the chimney sweep mode, the appliance can be set to the maximum output by turning the central heating dial to maximum. Now in maximum output, ensuring all other gas appliances are operating, check for the correct inlet gas pressure. Once the correct gas pressure has been established, turn the appliance off. Isolate the gas and remove the manometer from the gas inlet test point, ensuring to tighten the captive screw. Now the gas inlet pressure test is completed, the front fascia can be closed and the appliance can be turned back on. Ready to set the appliance temperature. This table shows the central heating dial numbers and the estimated temperature and application. Using the central heating dial, select the appropriate setting for your application. In the case of a combi boiler application, the domestic hot water temperature setting can also be selected. This table shows the domestic hot water dial numbers and the approximate outlet domestic hot water temperatures. Check your local regulations for the appropriate temperature setting and if a temperature limiting valve is required. This table shows us the symbols that can be displayed on the appliance display. The two symbols you will see when the appliance is first turned on is the air purge mode and the siphon fill mode, as seen here. An explanation of the full commissioning process and all display symbols can be found in the installation manual in the link below. The commissioning is now completed. Please ensure an explanation of how to operate the appliance is given to the end customer along with a copy of the user guide. Thank you for watching.